hopefully everyone's okay up ahead. We actually got off the interstate in El Reno and we were looking for Duff and then we got back on so maybe that saved us. Came back and Addie's sleeping over here. Hi Addie. Oh you woke up. Where's Simo? Oh Henry's over here. <laughs> Henry was up here when we left. Now Henry's over there. Simo. What happened to Ollie? He went out. Oh, it's kind of warm. You guys getting warm? Huh? Yeah. Not for long. <laughs> Get ready to be cold again. <laughs> oh, here we are back at the RV and as I said earlier, we did not have a buffet for like nine months. It was a long time. You know, we went to so many buffets, not so much in Quartzsite, there aren't any real buffets around there, but in Yuma, there was the Eat Chinese buffet and there was the Kuaishan breakfast buffet. And when we were with Aja and everybody, the tribe at the North Shore when we were there, we went like five or six, five times to the buffet and then we went to Mr. Fish and Chips one time. And so yeah. that's part of the reason we didn't get to hang out with them because we were always running. It's, it was a 45, if not an hour trip each way. And then the time, so, and the money, <laughs> you know, that's a lot of money to go to all those buffets. And then when we were with our friends in Yuma, later on, we went to like five buffets, I think. And it's just, it's too much time and money and it's just, we shouldn't be doing, you know, it's not good to go to the buffets that much. So we just, at, at that point, we just said, you know what, we've had it and we decided to not go anymore. Not a permanent decision, but for then. So hopefully we'll go less now. We were letting, I think we were letting the buffets rule us mm -hmm. instead of us ruling the buffets. And we, we thought it wasn't a good thing. So we thought we'd um, try to get it under control again. Not that we wouldn't go to any more buffets. I don't think we ever said we wouldn't. I think you said we never agreed we wouldn't go to any more buffets. Just that we had to take a break for a while and just consider doing it a little bit different. So it was nice. It was good. We might leave tomorrow, so we'll see. Because we still have some miles to go and we have another cold spell coming up that we have to get through. So Yeah. Henry. All right, well, we're leaving here. We were here for a couple of days and we're heading to our next destination. We got an over 300 mile trip and it's kind of windy. I'm driving for at least for a while and we'll see how it goes. The wind's supposed to quiet down as we get further through Oklahoma. Oklahoma! Oklahoma! Oklahoma, where the wind comes sweeping down the plain. Hello, Henry. You want to sing too? You want to sing? No? Okay. That's cool, that water. Tulsa, Oklahoma.
there's been some kind of a standstill on Interstate 40 West for a couple of miles and then it would start moving sometimes and then stand still again so hopefully everyone's okay up ahead we actually got off the interstate in El Reno and we were looking for Duff and then we got back on so maybe that saved us but we both prayed for whoever might be up ahead there and hopefully everyone's okay Walking around. Allie sleeping. Oh, and look at Henry. Henry's doing some serious sleeping over here. I think he kicked Seymour out of this. Oh, his eyes open now. I think he kicked Seymour out of this cat cave. He wanted it. Oh, now Seymour's in the other one. It's 12.15. We're ready to go to bed. We made it to our destination in Texilla, Oklahoma. We were in that whatever, that traffic for like an hour around Geary, Oklahoma. We saw, looked like something had burned. It might've been an RV. We're not sure. We're gonna try to look into it. It looked like it might've been an RV because it had two, it had a propane tank and I it don't know. Did? It did have a propane tank and in the burned, front, right? Yeah, and it burned, and it just—it was scary. Yeah, we were. I was praying for the people, whoever it was, whatever was going on. If anybody had any problems, I was praying for them, and then I was thankful that we were okay. Excuse me, but anyway, so and then we had to stop at Walmart because the cats needed food for tomorrow so anyway so we're here and we're ready for bed and we're gonna go to bed and rest and that's it i think that's it yeah we had a nice meal i had a nice dinner sharon bought me some nice food oh yeah we skipped the buffet at the casino instead of going two days in a row i said hey why don't we instead of spending 32 dollars on the buffet why don't we spend that on some fun groceries so I did that today. They so. were fun. Yeah, I you bought what did you buy? An Oreo cake? Some kind of Oreo parfait. And oh, I it was, found it was good. I found a pizza that was six something. It was stuffed crust. Oh, that was for really, sale. That was really good. <laughs> so we had a little party. All right. Good night, everybody. Good night, folks. Oklahoma where the stars are bright and the sky is big those aren't the words folks I don't know what the words are we saw look like something had burned it might have been excuse me <coughs> don't sneeze you sneezed on my shirt <laughs> <It's okay. laughs>